What's up, my peeps? My name is Gamergy Lucas. You could call me Lucas if y'all like. Sorry if you hear that noise in the background. It's my laptop is somewhat overheating, and my microphone is placed on top of my computer. But if you're seeing this video today, September 11th of 2011, then I completed somewhat of my mission that I just did today to post this video before 9/11 is over. But anyways, you know, since it is 9-11, I want to talk about it, you know, kind of my feelings towards it, kind of where I was at the time. Now, September 11th, 2001. The day was supposed to be, you know, a normal day for everybody, you know, everyone does what they do in their average lives, you know, work, go to school, anything like that. A couple of hours into the day, then a whole lot of people witnessed a plane crash into the Twin Towers, the World Trade Center. Then it was televised. From what I remember, which, you know, 10 years ago, you can barely remember barely anything. I remember, you know, me watching my... You know, my cartoons, you know, as a kid, you know, Looney Tunes or shit, you know, the good old days, but. I remember it was kind of interrupted. Now, since I'm Latino, back in the day I was living in New Mexico. And when something gets interrupted, you know, if a broadcast, a podcast, or anything like that gets interrupted, it is a huge event that's happening. See, there's something huge or breaking news or something like that. And, you know, me and my mom, I knew that. You know, I was like, oh my, something big must have happened then. And my parents, you know, some of them were watching television as well and, you know, other televisions they had. And they're seeing this. They are shocked, you know, surprised out of all. My parents are telling me since, you know, in Spanish, of course, it's like, oh, you know, you know, hope those people are okay. I hope they're safe, you know, hope no one's injured or hurt or dead. You know, in my mind, I was like, man, it must be serious, you know, but as a kid, I was like, well, you know, what, sh what can I do? I'm a kid. In my mind, I'm thinking, you know, oh, sad. And, you know, of course, since I wanted to watch back to my cartoons, I left it on the channel. And, you know, me being patient enough, I was just waiting and waiting till I got bored enough and I decided to start watching the news. That's when I, um... <sighs> Then I saw the second plane crash. And, you know, the announcers were like, oh my god. You know. And, you know, as a kid, me watching it was surprising. It scared, you know, it scared me because my idea of it is like, airplane crash is bad. Crashing into a building is worse. You know, to me, it's like, that was terrifying for me. You know, that was like one of like, the scary movie moments in my life. You know, I can't get, I still can't remember, I still remember that image, you know, of the plane just crashing and, and uh, me just watching and I don't remember my reaction, but I can definitely remember I did react to it. And, uh, yeah, you know, as a kid, you know, what can you do? You don't really know much, you know, kind of sad that, you know, that had to happen. It was a terrorist attack, you know, my parents told me that terrorists did this and you know my mom I'm like well what are these terrorists you know so my parents didn't want to go into much detail because they didn't want to get me scared as a kid you know a couple of years later I remember this because one of my teachers remembered me about it talking about it in the class and I was like I gotta remember this and um looked into some more information then I saw you know and everything, you know, speaking to my parents and all this stuff, they told me that an Al Qaeda member, Osama bin Laden, of course, um, plotted that attack and killed thousands of people. And my mom's like, "How cold-blooded can you be to to kill thousands of people for your own pleasure?" It really sickened me how Osama would have done such a thing. And you know, as a kid, you know, that's like nine or ten year old 
I understood the sub, you know, what happened, and, you know, it really sickened me. I didn't like it, and, you know, who can blame you? Everyone, you know, it's sad to know that this event had to happen. Ten and a half years later, no, nine and a half years later, sorry, we get him. We get Osama bin Laden, and he is now dead. And, um, not gonna say I hope he's burning in hell because you know he was just everyone starts off as a good person it's their surroundings that creates them maybe his surroundings around guns and you know bad people created a monster you know and uh, kinda made me sad you know that that happened and but sorry I can go on longer this video but that's about it um rest in peace to all the peeps up there who had suffered through this attack um rest in paradise you guys didn't deserve to die that's about it hope you guys enjoyed i'm out